an early morning fight by a bunch of boys at the Monterey Depot in 1916 led to the murder of one. I'm Dale Welch. I'm the Putnam County historian and I volunteer at the Monterey Depot Museum. March 19th of 1916, in the early morning hours, Alva Countess, who was the new night policeman, uh, he had just been on the job for a few days, heard a knock on, on his door. He came to the door, it was somebody from the, the depot saying that there, there was a bunch of boys fighting and, and it needed to be broke up. So he went and got his pistol and his coat and headed over to the depot. There was a bunch of boys inside the, the rail car fighting and he's trying to get them stuff. said, boys, go on home, go on home, but they wouldn't. And he started to reach to get one of the boys and out of the darkness, boom, he was shot. And then and not long, he lay dead on the ground. There was one boy fellow by the name of Herbert Whitaker. He was 19 years old at the time. He, he was eventually arrest, arrested after, after Countess's funeral. They tried him and he was found guilty the first time. But they asked for a, a, a retrial and in that one he got a plea deal where he just pled guilty to carrying a pistol served six months in the county workhouse and even got his pistol back. In the aftermath of the trial, uh, Herbert Whitaker, uh, and after, after World War I, went to Los Angeles, California and remained there the rest of his life. He only came back to Monterey when he was buried in, in Whitaker Cemetery. As for Alvis, Alva Countess's family, his wife had to get a job working at restaurants and stuff like that to to make a living for her four children and she eventually married another fellow.